Before we get started, I just want to say a massive thank you to EA for sending me an early access code as this video was made possible by the EA Game Changers program. Thank you! Hey guys, it's the Plum Dot here and welcome back to my channel for another video. I don't know if you guys have heard the word, the bird is the word, but Seasons has finally dropped in The Sims 4, so I thought I would take advantage of that and build four separate rooms to represent each season. April showers bring May flowers. Now I know it's June, but flowers here is the point. I decided that for spring, I was going to build a little florist shed somewhere where your gardener, your florist, your bot could come out, practice their career, their skills, and also I did throw in the corner a little bee box so that your bees would have somewhere to pollinate all the flowers because this room is chock full of flowers, full of plants, and it just made sense when I was laying everything down. Now I have to admit that spring is not my favorite season. I'm not somebody who deals well with the heat. Um, I just sort of shrivel up and prune and get all burnt and crisp and things like that i'm much more into the cooler weather uh, but this is one of the fate my favorite rooms that i did out of the four i really love how it turned out and i really like the new flora station that we got and it's got some really cute animations and your sims can just make some beautiful bouquets so yes i really really enjoyed that so there's the bee box that i placed down i do end up putting it in the opposite corner because i don't know i didn't want your sims to be getting attacked while they were putting together their bouquets so it's just in that little opposite corner there i know the room's not that big but hopefully the bees won't bother your florists while they are working on their craft now the windows that are above the sink i actually did change those off camera because i wanted to let a little bit more light in with all of these rooms i tried to use as much seasons content as possible uh, but i did use a little bit of base game and i think a couple other packs there's no no CC involved in these builds. I know shock horror, who am I? I'm not using CC, but I just wanted to use what the game offered us and especially as much seasons content as I possibly could. Now I will go back to those posts that you just saw me put in the corner and then also on the opposite wall because I really wanted to hang something from there, but nothing really looked right. And you'll see me struggle with it just a little bit. I think I had fairy lights hanging there at one point, but it just wasn't working out. So what do you guys like to do in the spring? Let me know down below in the comments. Some of my fondest spring memories from when I was growing up um, was actually playing softball. And I know that is an outside activity. And like I said, I much prefer being inside in the cozy warmth. Um, but I did play a lot of softball growing up. I used to travel around the country. I and I was on a competitive softball team and one of my fondest memories was actually traveling to Georgia and playing in a tournament there and let me tell you the girls that play softball in Georgia are on a different level because they play in the heat year round and coming from the rainy Pacific Northwest <laughs> We died out there on the field. We just couldn't keep up with the girls that were used to the heat. Um, but it was a lot of fun to be able to travel with my softball team. And I continued playing softball as an adult. So I played from... 18 to 25 I think and I played in different teams around the world I played on a UK team and um, I played with my US team in Vegas so that was a lot of fun and as I got older I actually got into softball coaching so I actually had the opportunity to coach a lot of my nieces I've got seven nieces and I had the opportunity to coach every single one of them, I think, played softball. So that was a lot of fun, um, coaching and kind of taking my skills or giving my skills to them and, and showing them what I learned on the softball pitch. So I did have a lot of fun with that. But yeah, let me know down below what some of your favorite spring memories are and what sort of your spring favorite spring holiday. I know we've got Easter in spring. Um, 
when I was little, we used to have massive Easter egg hunts. My mom used to put on these huge Easter egg hunts and she still continues it to this day. Even though my youngest niece is 14 years old, she still puts on a great Easter egg hunt around um, their house. And now because all my nieces and nephews are older, instead of hiding chocolate and um, candy in the eggs like I got when I was little, she actually hides money. Not real money, um, but it's play money and then my nieces and nephews can go and exchange it for the real thing. Um, but yeah, oh how times have changed. When I was little, it was all about the chocolate and the candy and now my nieces and nephews get money. Lucky them. Um, there's a golden egg that's involved with this whole Easter egg hunt that my mom does and um, it's worth a hundred dollars and I'm like, here I am eating my Cadbury's egg chocolate. Thanks, mom. <laughs> But anyway, we are almost finished with this spring florist shed, so I am going to wrap this up here. But if you enjoyed this, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know all about your guys' springs. And make sure you guys stick around to my channel because we've got summer, fall, and winter coming up. And if you guys aren't already subscribed and you like what you see, why don't you go ahead and hit that button. Don't be a plum stranger now, guys. Bye!